Notre Dame special teams coordinator Brian Polian met with the media on Tuesday morning to discuss some key special teams players, guys that he's hoping to use on different punt, punt return, kick, all those kind of um, special teams units. Polian also touched on the key punt return names to keep an eye on. Make sure you guys hit the thumbs up button on this video to like it and uh, subscribe to our channel for more content. Jack Lamb decided to graduate transfer to, uh, I believe, he ended up at Colorado and and seeking more playing time on, on on defense. But Jack Lamb might have been our best special teams player last year. I mean, he played phenomenally. Brock Wright is a was a staple and the signal caller on the punt team. Another guy that that is going to be hard to replace. Uh, thankfully, Bo Bauer, Kaiser. Uh, Leah Fow, Pryor, Houston. They're, they, I am very blessed this year. Th a lot of our core guys are veterans that have played a bunch. Um, I want J.D. Bertrand to take on a more expanded role. Uh, I want to identify uh, some wide receivers. Can Styles help us? Um, you know, can, can um, Jay Brunel find a way to get on the field to help us? Um, you know, I'm excited to get Audric in when he reports in the fall because to have a running back body that size, I think he can be a four unit special teams player. Um, you know, we've got to get Ramon Henderson going. We've got to get Clarence Lewis going. Uh, I'm really pleased with the camp that KJ Wallace has had so far. I am very pleased with Justin Walters and Philip Riley. They are fast risers right now in all the work that we're doing. So uh, we'll identify who those core guys are. Uh, we've lost a couple that were trusted, trusted players that we have to get replaced, but we're bringing a lot of vets back, which I, I feel lucky about. As it relates to the punt return game, I'm glad this question got asked because, I, you know, there, there's a lot of chatter out there about that. Like, why can't we just put Chris Tyree back there to catch a punt? And I don't think that people understand how difficult a skill, how, how difficult it is to catch a punt and how specialized the skill that is. And we recognize how good a football player Chris Tyree is, but in the end, the security of the football and the transition of it from our defense to our offense is the single most important factor. And if Chris is not yet comfortable, and there are times when he articulates to us, I'm not quite there yet. I'm not going to roll him out there, um, you know, on national TV if, if he's not comfortable yet. Um, we, we've had Styles back there catching, which has been very encouraging. Riley has been catching balls. Keys has been back there. Uh, Tyree continuing to work. But in the end, whatever choice we make will be with ball security first in, in mind. That's the priority, the, the transition of the football. And, and I think what you saw last year was when we made the decision to put Salerno back there because he catches the ball, um, we amped up our pressure. And we blocked two punts and we've, we've, we've blocked some punts now the last couple of years, but there are a bunch of times that we get close and we force a 38 yard punt. Well, that's, that's a good thing. If we can, if we heat people up and we make them uncomfortable and, and we force a poor kick, that's as good as an eight to 10 yard return. So, you know, it, it, it will shift our mindset a little bit, but in the end, Whoever's back there, the, the first choice is going to be predicated on uh, ball security first and foremost.